and welcome back to my channel and in today's video I'm gonna be sharing a few different experiences with you guys today so right now and I'm also with my mama hi she is here visiting from Seattle so yay we're having so much fun um, but right now we're at Trader Joe's so we are gonna go in Trader Joe's I'm going in for the first time you guys I've heard about you guys talking about Trader Joe's I've seen other videos other youtubers reviews all that good stuff so I'm gonna actually go in there and check it out for myself pick up a few things and share my experience so anyway I'm also gonna share another experience with you later today I'm just gonna put this all in one video just because I'm super busy and I have to do that um, I'm also going to be getting a derma planning treatment done along with a micro peel I believe it's called so I'm gonna be getting those two treatments done today this afternoon and I'm gonna go ahead and vlog it a little bit for you guys and I'm doing that because I asked you guys this morning on my Instagram if you guys wanted to see my experience or hear about it or know about it and most of you the majority of you besides like less than 10% said you did so I want to make sure that I get that information in this video and just share my whole experience of today. Also, I do want to mention that I was sent this planner from Clever Fox. They sent me this planner. I absolutely love this planner because it helps you with your goals, your daily goals, your life goals, um, just balancing life. The material on it is super fun. What kind of material would you say this is? Leather? Pleather? Or? Um, I don't yeah. know. It's kind of a rubber leather. But look at this, my gratitude and self-awareness, I am grateful for, and you just kind of write in there like a daily journal, what I'm passionate about, what brings me joy in life, my affirmations, my daily rituals, your goals here. Um, you can do health, business career, family friends, significant other and romance. I mean, the list goes on. Finance, personal development. I think you guys will really enjoy it, especially I know a lot of you guys are on a similar journey to me, and you guys share it on your social medias, and I just think everyone should take the time out journal and kind of work on yourself so I will have their information down below and we're gonna go ahead and continue on with this vlog so I hope you guys enjoy it Spicy peanut vinaigrette. So, oh, this, I might want to try this. I love cilantro. They have just such fun stuff. I'll never think I'd be on But if I wait too long, I will be waiting. I bet the second chance will not be dating. I want to hide away, but it be fading. I know the second chance will not be waiting. If you guys want to know what my favorite snack in the world is, but I can't get them right now, is this. The yogurt pretzels. They are so bomb. I don't get them from here, but from another store. Alright you guys, so we are back right now. I'm going to show you the things that we got. And my mom, she was like, you totally have to invest in one of, in these bags. So these are like recycled bags. They're 99 cents and they're super cute. So I will show you everything that we got. Okay, mind you, my coverage all open. <laughs> that this is just stuff that um, I'm trying out for the first time or stuff that my mom recommended that she has tried out when she has gone. So these aren't like necessities. This isn't like a huge grocery haul to show you guys um, what I get weekly or anything like that. Just keep in mind. Obviously, you guys probably know because you watch my channel, but anyway. Um, so I did get this grapefruit scented candle. Smells amazing like grapefruit fruit, and it's a soy candle. I had to get it. You guys know I love my soy candles. And then the next thing I got was for Remy, and it is organic chicken and brown rice recipe sticks. This is wheat-free um, puppy and dog treats. So this is the Trader Joe's brand. This is Speculus. Well, it's a Trader Joe's brand. Is all the stuff Trader Joe's brand? 
Not everything, most everything. Okay, yeah. so most of the things for you guys that don't know, it's Trader Joe's and that means it's like organic, non-GMO and stuff like that. So this is a cookie and cocoa swirl. So I'm definitely using this as a spread or in my protein shakes. I had to try it, it looks so good. And then the next thing is my mom suggested getting this Italian blood orange soda, which I haven't had Italian sodas in a long time. So we're gonna drink some of this soon. If you guys have tried this, let me know down below. Um, and then I did get some spinach because I needed some for lettuce or for salads. I'm trying to hurry up because I do have to go to my appointment in like less than 30 minutes. So um, I am gonna document that too for you guys as best as I can. But um, these peanut butter cups, my mom said were amazing. They're like Reese's peanut butter cups. So um, we're gonna try that. Um, and then I got this famous thing that everybody has told me about. It is all about the, or everything but the bagel sesame seasoning blend with sea salt, garlic, and onion. I have heard so many great things about this. So I finally got my own spinach artichoke dip. It's a creamy spinach artichoke dip. My mom knows I love artichoke dip and so she picked this up and I'm excited to try it. So the next thing is this cilantro salad dressing and then the other salad dressing is this Trader Joe's sweet onion and barbecue vinaigrette. Some strawberries because we love strawberries. I got all of us some more of these eggs. What are these eggs called? Baby Bell. Baby Bell, that's right. All right, I said eggs. <laughs> so I got all of them more of these cheeses, the Baby Bell cheeses, because she loves those for snacks. It's just breaded calamari, and this is by, it's panko breaded calamari. So anyway, the prices are really, really good at Trader Joe's. Um, my mom goes there quite often back in Seattle, so she gets a lot of great deals and a lot of like organic and healthy things too. So yay for Trader Joe's. I'm really excited to try out these things. All right, you guys, so I'm actually here in the room now, and I'm with Sarah. You are the esthetician. Esthetician. esthetician yes. That's going to be doing the derma planning on my face and the micro peel. And the derma planning, it's going to remove um, dead skin. It's going to remove like hair or any hair follicles. Your fine balance hair, like that little peach fuzz that you get all over yeah. your skin, and then it takes the dead skin off. Yes, and that gives you like a better appearance in your skin over time. And then also paired with the peel, it's really nice because it lets the peel sink deeper. I did read that if you do get this done like your products are gonna your skincare line or skincare products are gonna work a lot better and taking care of your face and stuff like that so I'm really excited Oh god. So I'm gonna have you go ahead and just wipe it out though, just to make sure it's oh, not weird. Wet out. He's not the one cause he's playing with you. Yeah, you, the, with this you shouldn't feel anything. It's just scraping off. You can see it's just scraping off dead skin. Right. Hair There's, and skin. That all came off my face, you guys. So you. <laughs> So sometimes the toner can sting a little bit. It's not even the peel yet. Sometimes people feel strongly and sometimes you don't. I'm surprised I do, because I feel like I have a high tolerance for pain, but maybe not. <laughs> maybe not my face. So this right here, so see how those okay. are getting kind of white and around your nose right yeah. here in the creases? So that's the frosting. Mm -hmm. Usually that just means that's kind of where you're gonna peel the most. Most people do peel around their mouth more than I think anywhere. I've seen that on video before. Because it's so much thinner. So I wanted to go ahead and show you guys kind of how my face looked today. Um, and just kind of update you. This is the second day of my, since I had my derma planning and my micro peel or chemical peel. And so this is kind of how my face looks. I can't wear makeup or do anything with my face or go in direct sun until tomorrow. So yeah, it's still kind of red around here and then it's dry in this area and dry here, which is totally fine. That's just the kind of what happens. Everyone kind of reacts to it different, but it's all working. So yeah, anyway, I am gonna have to have a couple more treatments, which I will keep you guys posted about that. You guys see I have a lot of acne scarring, so I definitely, to get this stuff faded, 
all that faded it's gonna take more than one treatment um, there are some of her clients that had had one treatment and actually faded it a great deal but we're gonna actually know more tomorrow so the third day is when we'll see like more more of a progress so I'll definitely check in with you guys tomorrow before I close out this vlog and show you guys kind of how it looks and if any fading um, happened I should have took a better picture yesterday when I started but it's just the very next day so I just wanted to check in with you guys and I will see you guys in my next clip. All right, you guys, so it is the third day of my uh, chemical peel and derma planning. So the, obviously the chemical peel is going to start to make your skin kind of flake and dry up in different, different areas. So um, this is the first day that I'm putting on makeup because, and the only reason why I'm putting on makeup um, is because I have to film a video for a company that's going on their website. It's for Mother's Day and I have to get that done. Um, so I'm just basically gonna like hide this side because this side of my face, you guys, is peeling off so bad and adding makeup, foundation, and powder and stuff, it makes it way worse. So today I only added, added foundation, but all of that there is peeling and just gritty and all of that. And then here, all of this, I mean, that looks disgusting, so. <laughs> that is the side effect that's a symptom my skin doesn't feel as tight today as it did yesterday and on the first day so anyway I wanted to update you guys I love you guys so much thank you for watching if you have any other questions about my um, little procedure thing that I had done or whatever you want to call it the service um, go ahead and ask me down below and I'll see you guys in my next video Bye, guys.